The structure of a master's degree, you start with the very introduction of a thesis, which is the main objective of, uh, of the master's degree. And later on, you will, start, you will start to add other information to this uh, thesis. So this is done with each block and you are never doing one entire subject all at once. It's, uh, you're being helped uh, throughout, uh, throughout the weeks with every single uh, subject that you are uh, struggling with. But also it, it gives you time to explore what you're already working on. Uh, but the theory is always uh, most likely different from the other students that are also following the master's course. So it's never really uh, exactly the same but you can still follow the several courses that will help you get to the end result of your uh, thesis question uh, or research question. My, uh, my research question is about uh, concept art and I want to uh, actually figure out what is the most uh, professional way of working with uh, concept art. So is it fine to use uh, uh, the tools that are given in uh, the, def the different uh, digital softwares or is it better to just go from scratch and just draw everything by hand and see how far you can get. I send out uh, a lot of questionnaires. I pretty much get my research uh, data from questionnaires that I send out to professionals but also to students who are currently doing uh, a master's or bachelor degree uh, in the same subject. A few of the courses here are very um, uh, very industry driven and very very back to basics sometimes uh, when it comes to you asking a question they will help you to, to get uh, to improve this by making a course or a workshop uh, in the master's case you can also make your own workshop that you can give to uh, other students um, but the courses overall are very similar to the bachelor's degree painting, uh, digital painting, perhaps photo bashing, which is also a form of painting. Uh, but there are also courses for programming, uh, in-depth programming, designing, uh, level designing, all these subjects. In my case, I'm working with painting and uh, concept art. So these are very uh, specific courses that I follow to help me with my eventual uh, thesis. The contents of uh, well, the master's uh, workshops and, uh, and classes in general are pretty much um, everything that's been, uh, that's been going on at uh, the bachelor's degree. Uh, because you are never really um, uh, done with learning about the basics, but also there are sometimes le guest lecturers and uh, industry professionals who will help uh, students with uh, portfolio um, questions or something like that. Uh, and there are specific courses for the masters, of course, uh, where they will actually go into detail about how to make a thesis or how to do some planning for your thesis, um, reaching out to test participants and all these subjects that will eventually come to light when you uh, apply to, uh, to the master's course.